literally whispering in your ear. Yeah, we're gonna relax and flick some chill tonight with Jason and Marta. Um, this apartment is very sparsely decorated and it kind of looks like shit. I should probably go from here. Hello everyone and welcome to Pyro Falcon's streaming Sundays. Today is August 20th, 2017, and you are watching Flix and Chill. What's up with the butter voice? It's Flix and Chill. I'm gonna be banging people. We have to be uh, all sensual and shit. In this crap-ass apartment? In this crap-ass apartment, I, that's I don't, right. I don't think so. Can we have Nurse No-No Square as well? No, she's <laughs> completely turned off from this situation because this apartment looks... Just the worst. Why am I holding a controller? Hi, everyone. Welcome to Streaming Sundays. We are playing Flicks and Chill. I got this idea off of Markiplier, who recently played the sequel, but these games are available on Steam for 99 cents. Right now, as I'm talking, they're on sale for 49 cents. Go friggin' buy them. They're, it's less than a goddamn taco a taco I'm going Bell. to buy them right now, in fact. So, um, we are going to be playing this with the audience, the Blazing Hawks. You can see them in the top left corner, and we are going to have a rotation system going. Thank you, Tank. Yes, Butter Voice Pyro doesn't make an appearance very often, but sometimes he does. So we're going to start with episode zero, which is Jason and Marta, and this is a... Yeah, so this is just a just a little room a dating simulator, choose your own adventure kind of game. It's going to be nice and relaxing. A game by. Right. Um, yeah, so the Akamura is keeping the rotation. If you are late to the party and want to sign up, let us know in the chat and we will add you to the rotation so you can play along with us. And I guess I have to hit the play button. Boop. Uh. Very chip to me. I kind of like it. Flicks and chill. You know, I was also late to the party, knowing, not realizing that flicks and chill meant sex, or Netflix and chill meant sex. Oh. Oh boy, my Tinder date will be here super soon. Super soon. Man, I hope it goes well. Uh. Oh. Just need to get a few things set up. Oh, I have to do things. I thought it was just a pure choose your own adventure. Boop. All right, Netflix is a go. Now all we need is the chill. Let's see, can we do mood lighting? Boop! I booped it. Chill a straight. Oh Jesus! Oh Can't my even God. finish saying it I without hurting. I hate this hurting. guy immediately. Oh, that must be my date. Oh man, does my hair look good? Do I have something in my teeth? Oh yeah, I don't have teeth. Whew. One last thing to worry about. Your pronunciation must be shit if you don't have teeth. Here goes nothing. Deep breaths, Jason. Deep breaths. Just another person. Just another person. Glad I got the mouse. Oh, I have to actually click the door. Hey, baby. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello there. Uh, welcome. All right, we're gonna. Lord Ariados, you're up first. Is he? Oh, yep. I was going to do me, you, and then the fans, oh, okay. as usual. So, we're going to gonna, gonna hug. Hey, baby. Oh, a uh, cool place. Ah, oh, denied. I'm, I'm just pretending to be a zombie. Were you talking to yourself a moment ago? And that's you, the Akamara. No. Oh, no, that's probably just the TV you were hearing. I'm not crazy or anything. <laughs> right. Well, come on in. The graphics are adorable. Especially in the second one. Anywho. So, what are we watching? What are we watching? We'll give this one to Lord Ariados with our 10 second delay. Hopefully it comes quickly. Just have to manage to blather like an idiot to fill the time until we get an answer from Lord Arian. One of these days, Discord is going to be introducing screen share and major uh, group calling. I don't know why I said major. Superhero series. Boop. A new superhero series just came out. I figured we could get into it together. 
Whoa, whoa there, Jason. We only just met. Let's get to know each other a bit before deciding to make a commitment like that. Ha. Uh, Uh-oh. Yeah. Sorry. I guess I got a little carried away. Plant ass. Aw. It's like you... (laughs) Ten minutes later? Wow, this date's moving kind of fast. Wait. Oh, we're just still sitting here. Never mind. Nothing's moving fast. So, uh... So, uh... I just realized that with these movie dates, it's kind of hard to get to know the person, you know? Couldn't agree more. So, what do you say we... Who's up? Lord Ariados. He answered super Oh, uh, Tink. Tink. You're Tink. Right. How, what are we going to do now that we're sitting here together? The music's pretty relaxing. <laughs> <laughs> He's screaming from this awkward situation. But don't you want to just, like, fist your hand real deep into an awkward situation like this? Exactly, right. It really rankles up your freaking yard hairs. It's great. The one I'm really missing from this is uh, Kalo's lady, Ayla, because she would cho- intentionally choose everything to uh, to sabotage the date. Yeah. Tink says we're going to move on to something a little more interesting, if you know what I mean. Um... Like what? Uh, Tofa, you're up. Tofa's up. But yeah, I like stuff like this because you can control the awkward. Yes, controlling the awkward is fun. Now that I'm playing this, I feel like Mark did this too. Didn't he do this one before? I don't know. I don't mean that. I think he did this one. I think he did the original. I, I don't think he did the rest of the ones in the series, though. I haven't really been keeping track of Mark's stuff lately. Tofa says, make a move. Oh, uh, yeah, you seem like a really great guy, Jason. I just don't know you that well yet. Uh, You're up. Oh, I'm up? I'm gonna persist. Oh, I'm gonna Kalo's added to the rotation. Kalo. Okay. Put him, uh, after me, since I just sort of jumped him. Okay. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure, though I admire your persistence. <laughs> well, at least I tried, right? <laughs> yeah. Ah, that actually worked out. You would have reacted well if I persisted, too. I, Sorry, I just had a flashback. I'm like, we wouldn't be in this situation because if we were sitting on the couch together, you would have just jumped me. There would have uh, been no hesitation like this back I then. I mean... I'm thinking I probably would have laid across you and waited until you had to pee. Like a cat. Yes. I have an idea. How about we have a conversation? (laughs) Conversations are always nice. What do you want to have a conversation about? Let's have a deep intellectual discussion about society. Um, okay. That's a pretty broad subject, though. Have anything more specific in mind? Wow, we can go pure anarchy. Your turn, Kalo. Yep, you're up, Kalo. No gods, no masters! <laughs> Just and throw a mall. Flips a switch on the wall and it turns into communist manifesto shit. <laughs> oh, wait, we're talking anarchy, not communism. I would like to see him just fling a uh, Molotov cocktail into his own house. The cops send tear gas in and he like <laughs> picks it up with his fingers and definitely wings it back at him. Oh, man. You'll never take me alive! And she's just on the couch. I thought this was a sex date! <laughs> is that Tinder? Is that all Tinder is? Is Tinder At just sex? At this point, yeah. Really? Yep. I don't know anything about any of those it since... It started as a legitimate casual dating app, but it's just meeting up for hookups. I see. Bye, Ryu. I understand. Actually, he's probably left already. Is it really only 10 seconds? This is trying to kill me. Oh, there's Kalo. Down with society. He agrees. Down with society. <laughs> You're joking, right? Ooh. My a, turn. Your of turn. Of course. <laughs> of course I'm kidding. Society's great. Why is it great? You're quite the interviewer, huh? <laughs> hey, you're the one making all the bold statements. 
Okay. Society is great because... Oops. Lord just... Ariados, you're up. Accidentally clicked the thing. Might stick the timer back in the corner to double check my delay. I was going to say, to then. both of those, political views aside. Whoops. Ah, sorry about that. This is another one of those games where clicking off defocuses the audio, which is a uh, situation that making I do progress. not like. We're making progress. Despite, oh shit, despite all the craziness in the news and the constant fear, gloom and doom is p it spits at us, if you really look at the numbers, we're like at the best point in history. I mean, we have the lowest child, god damn, this is getting deep. I mean, we have the childest, the lowest child mortality rate of all time, women have more rights than ever, and so many people have internet access right now. I'd say it's actually a pretty great time to be alive. Wow. Very inspirational speech. I feel the same way. The world's not as bad a place as some news stations would have us believe. Got that right. Hey, what do you say we play a game? Okay, what do you have in mind? Let's play Truth or Dare. <laughs> what is this, sixth grade? Uh, who's up? Tink. Tink is up. Option three for Ayla. We should add Ayla to the list and just always pick the bottom option. All right, Ayla's going in after Topa. Like, that that does sound like something, because it seems like the bottom option is always either the most awkward or most ridiculous. So, yeah, we'll, we'll have an honorary Ayla option for Kalo. Um, who's up, you said? Tink. Tink is up? Oh, okay. You, you checking? What? You checking or something? Me? No way. But you're going first, since it's your idea. Works for me. Okay, Jason. Truth or dare? Hmm. Tofa, you're up. This is a tough choice. Have you ever played Truth or Dare? Uh, once or twice. Really? Yep. I can't remember if I've ever played it. I was trying to search my memory, but I didn't do slumber parties very much or anything like that. By the time I even had friends over who stayed, Tofa says dare. And you are up. Glad to see you're not a wimp. Okay. I dare you to... Yes? Hold on. Trying to think of a good one. First thing that comes to mind. I dare you to do your sexiest dance. Oh, God. Don't ever ask me to do that. <laughs> you're joking, right? Why would I be joking? What? You scared? Who's up? Uh, Ayla? That would be Ayla. So, bottom option. <laughs> I ain't scared. Oh, Jesus. You're up. I'm up. Let's twerk. We're gonna twerk, twerk it. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, I should put my Yumero voice in there. Uh, 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 uh. You like that, baby? God, I'm gonna wanna send myself Work it, work it. That. Oh, yeah. I just heard that very <laughs> savage voice. <laughs> You're so funny. What can I say? But I was born this way. <laughs> Hold the applause. I like this game because it's it's cheesy. It's not like... Like, I can see this being a legit kind of situation, you know? Yes, it's cute. <laughs> it's very cute. That was amazing. Why, thank you. Okay, your turn, Marta. Truth or dare? Although I wouldn't mind doing a dare, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna have to go with truth since it's already steamy enough in here with that <laughs> dance you did. <laughs> Understandable. Okay, my question for you is. Ooh, Kalo's turn. Kalo's turn. Please respond in the chat. Oh, I was so nervous that the that the uh, delay was gonna kill us in this one. I still miss Hitbox and it's four second delays. Actually, it could be your turn since I kind of stole the twerk. No, that's fine. Twerk is fine. I was actually thinking that anyway. Plus, it was the most ridiculous and hilarious. Oh shit, I clipped at one point. I got my volume all over the place lately. Check, 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 check. There we go. That's probably a little better. Wherever Kayla went. 
Kalo seems to be on a longer delay than the rest of us. Aww. I don't think he's on a 10 second delay. I Curse think his delay you, is Atlantic long. Ocean! Yeah. Because he's. There we go. He's up. See, he, he's listening and playing. He's just behind a bit. What do you think of me? Make a move. What do you think about? Aww. She's scooting down. Uh, um, yeah, you seem like a really great guy, Jason. I just. I don't know you that well yet. Can I say this Jason kind of looks like Jason Brody from Far Cry? Head cannon accepted. Who's up? I am. Withdraw and apologize. Boop. Oh, um, I'm sorry. I just it's, have blue balls. It's cool. My balls are I as blue guess. as my shirt. On that note, let's go back to the show, huh? Won't fight you there. Aw. They missed half the plot because of the twerk. Hey, it's been nice, but I think it's about time I left. After only 35 minutes? What? So soon? Okay. Something yeah, glitched. I'm just, I have some laundry to do. I am scared. Stop floating, please. <laughs> You're up, Lord Ariados. Uh-huh. Uh. Kalo is being Ethan Mars? What was his name? Not Ethan Mars. Or is it Ethan Mars? What the hell is his name? It's... Ethan. It's Ethan. He is Ethan Mars. God, I should have done that game for the show, too. Lord Eridos says, number two. Come on, just stay for a little bit longer. Having a good time, you're just... Sitting there, I mean, you may as well sit on the couch if you're going to sit. I don't know. I have work tomorrow and I should be getting to bed early. Who's up? Uh, it'd be Tink. And, hi, Tari. Um, ah, oh, you're very sweet. Don't forget, Tari, that this is an audience participation. If you want to join us, just let us know in the comments and we will add you to the list. Hopefully we are on a short enough delay that you will find it fun. Excuse me. And Tink says we're going to stand up and convince her. Look at this. See, see, Marta, I can use my legs. Who's up? Tofa. Tofa. What, ex what, how are we begging this poor young lady to stay with us? Let us know in the comments. Or the chat, rather. Oh, man. I might... I might do number two just to play that song. They're, like, the song is what really got me, because the rave music in number two is really good. Because it doesn't see... Up, oh, Tofa says, I can get snacks! I, I, could... I, I can get snacks! <laughs> no, thank you. I'm not hungry. Aw. It's been fun. Denied! Hello, Achievement. Thank you. You e too, e Marta. You too, Marta, Aww. yeah. Uh, okay, I'm you just, just gonna you hoverboard just... out of here. <laughs> I don't know how we triggered that glitch, but it was great. Tell her your feelings! Aw, that's the end of the first episode. But we're going... Like, Mark kept playing it until he got him to hook up. Oh, that's awesome, yes. Music credits. Anyway, Mark kept playing it until he got him to hook up. But we have five episodes here, so we're going to keep moving on. Ah, That's kind of cool. Neat. I looked through the uh, developer, or rather the publisher, and the publisher in this for this game is a little sketchy, but the developer knows what he's doing. I really like it. I Boop. have a thing in my Steam Boop. inventory. Trevor Who and Samantha. Sent me what? 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 What are you doing? I have a new item in my inventory. What? What are you playing? Steam. Oh, I see. Okay, I think this is the place. Oh. It's a coupon. Oh, I have tickets for some reason. Oh, no, it's money. God, what the hell's wrong with me? I got a coupon yeah. for another game because I own one. Now, where is my date? Dang it. I should have asked for more descriptive pictures. And this guy looks like Ollie from Far Cry 3. Okay, this... Hey there. Oh, um, hello. Oh, uh, 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 wow. You're stunning. Aw, that's so sweet. 
It's good to meet you in person. Wow, you're way prettier than you sounded online. Um, you have the wrong Chica essay. Ah, oh, denied. The rest of them is dudes. Am I here just for a dude? Which is fine. Uh, you? Because you're the only other girl, it looks like? Hey, are you Samantha? Yep, that's me. Oh, thank God, finally. Um, who are those people you were talking to? Uh, who's up? Uh, that would be Kalo. Kalo, you're up. Tell her your feelings, Tari says. Tari, do you want to join us? Please let us know in the chat if you want to be added to the rotation. And... Yeah, that was from a bit ago. Sorry, I don't timestamp the live chat, so I'm usually reacting to it way late. Tari wants to be part of the rotation. Hey! And Kalo says three. What, people? I didn't talk to anyone else. Are you serious? I literally just saw you talking to someone. I have no idea what you're talking about. I can't tell if you're being serious right now or if you're messing with me. Neither can I, to be honest. But... Hey dudes, let me know when you're ready to order and if you need any help. I almost Dr. Mr. Bad touched him, so you just saved the audience's ears. Let me think. Your order first. Okay, let's check out the menu. Just a cup of coffee, mother's milk latte, ew, pumpkin spice autumn explosion, super mocha frappuccino. And it looks like we only have four bucks and some change anyway. Probably want to go cheap here. Yeah, let's go with just a cup of coffee. It's my turn. Oh, is it? Uh-huh. Uh, boop. Oh. Boop. Wait, what? Oh, our coffee's the best. Comes from our organic fair trade shade-grown village in South America where they worship the coffee oh, bean. Jesus. They believe the coffee bean contains the spirits of the wilderness that, when consumed, gives them special powers. So that's what you want? Yep. Done. Here you go, dude. Here's your Joe. I think I'll just get a cup of coffee. You mean our just a cup of coffee? Sure. That. One just a cup of coffee coming right on up. That'll be one ninety-five. Oh. I'll get the pumpkin spice latte, please. You got it, sweetheart. One pumpkin spice latte coming right on up. Aw, oh, this is what you want us to do. You want us to be in a coffee shop, ordering our drinks, hanging out. So, how do you feel about meeting someone on OK Stupid? <laughs> Who's up? <laughs> that is a great name for a uh, for a for a dating site. All right, Lord Aritos. Tap 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 tap. But yeah, this is the Akamura's dream. See, she wants us to be in a coffee shop in Seattle, sitting across from each other, enjoying coffee while I'm working on my latest book, and she's just hanging out and doing things. So nothing to do, nice. nowhere to be. It's my first time, actually, so I don't know how to feel about it yet. Yeah, me neither. I mean, I met a couple of guys on the site, but I don't know. We didn't really make a connection, you know? And who's up? Tink. Tink. Yeah, that happens, or, well, what did you do? What? I think I'd have to hear the tone on that when the context doesn't make sense. Tari says cat cafe. Oh, God, yep. that'd be adorable. They have those in Japan. You go to a cafe and you pet cats. Uh, Clayton George, I will continue it. Um, I always continue all my series. Well, that's not true, but I usually continue my series. Um, I'll get to it. I just cycle series, and uh, Evil Genius has kind of been pushed to the back, but I will continue it, believe me. And I will be all over Evil Genius 2 whenever it comes out. Tink says, option two. Well, what did you do? <laughs> One of the dates when he we went bowling, and he kept trying to teach me how to bowl. You know, touching me a lot. It was just weird. I barely knew him. God damn, the music's loud. Up next is Tofa. Uh, okay. Sorry about again cutting off the music. Can't help the the uh can't help the defocus. Um, but yeah, for anyone new, which I keep getting new subscribers, which believe me, thank you guys very much. Um. Yeah, I, I rotate series. I'll usually do eight episodes of something at a time, and then do eight episodes of something else at a time, and then switch, and then blah, 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 blah. Keep going back and forth. 
Tova says, I hate bowling. Oh yeah, that sounds horrible. I hate bowling. It's so boring. I do not feel that way in real life. I mean, I like bowling, I just didn't like the unwarranted contact, you know? Eh, I just think bowling's a dumb game. I like golf. So slow, man. <laughs> yeah, sure. Ah, here comes our drinks. Oh yeah, we never actually got our drinks. Alright, I got one just a cup of coffee and one pumpkin spice autumn explosion for you guys. Thanks, buddy. There's your shit. <sighs> Who's up? That would be... Ayla, which means we're gonna stare, stare challengingly. And make him go away. Wow, <sighs> thank you. Uh, I will leave you to it then. <sighs> See, I like Ayla being a uh, an what optional extra. What was that about? Here. Do you know him or something? Him? No. I just knew he was expecting a tip, but I was definitely not gonna give it to him. I'll give you a tip, though, baby. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Why? The way he described those drinks was pretty amazing. Eh, I don't tip. I don't believe in it. How can you not believe in tipping? This is not going well. I think this discussion has uh, already been beat to death. Congratulations, Trevor. You're dating me. So, you told me online that you're studying English Lit, right? What made you pick that major? Who's up? Uh, that would be Tari. Tari! Why did we pick the major? Please let us know in the chat. And, uh, just for the record, Clayton George, for those of you who are watching this from the archive, he's got an evil genius uh, icon or avatar. As he tells us, good man, evil never sleeps. I'm still upset that I never got to play Evil Genius um, online, which was a Facebook game, which I didn't realize existed until literally one month before it sunset. So I didn't bother playing it because it was going to friggin' sunset. So um, if I had known, it would have been one of the few Facebook games I would have actually played very, very hard. Sorry. This music is all over the bloody place. Good God, man. Give me minus 18 decibels and then it should be fine. Come on. Yep, 18-1. That works. That should be good. Good balance. Are you using the fan? Do you mind Hi, if Tari. I cycle it? It's in the bedroom. Oh. Uh, yes. Tari. Hi, it's okay. No worries. You. One. Right. That works. Easy major. Eh, I just picked it because it looked easy. I got in on an athletic scholarship, so I really just had to pick anything. Are you serious? You got into an Ivy League school and you just picked a random major? This is not a date that's going well. That would be you? Uh, I'm gonna try to salvage this. I still enjoy it. I mean, I still enjoy it. I love reading old books. I'm just more passionate about track and field, you know? Yeah, I guess I could respect that. Uh, hi, sir. <clears throat> Samantha? Oh, okay. Jeff? Oh my god, I didn't even recognize you! <laughs> yeah, wow, it's so nice to see you! You look amazing! <laughs> yeah, you too! <laughs> Ahem. Oh, sorry about that. I'm Jeff, an old friend of Samantha's. <laughs> I wouldn't say that old. And you are? That uh, would be you. I think. No, wait. I think it's Kalo. Did you just pick? Yeah, you just picked, so it's Kalo. No, that was a that was an emergency pick since it was time. He's <laughs> like, who is this Dberg? <laughs> um. Yeah, I'll give this one to Kalo. I I that was a speed one, so I had to choose something quick. But, since it came up during my turn anyway, that's fine. Alright, Kalo, it's all you. What do we do to uh, Mr. Deberg here? I also love the fact that while we're waiting, you can see in the background, like, that lady is typing away. So, this is just very... We're making this more awkward by just staring at this dude with his arm out. And I'm gonna open my window, because it is hot as tits today. Oh, do you want me to go get the other fan real quick? That's fine. <laughs> That's faster. Uh, and doesn't require either of us leaving the microphone for uh, longer than a couple seconds. Oh, breeze, uh, thank you. <sighs> this is the first day it's been this hot. Like, we've we've had a fairly cool summer here in Ohio this year. 
We had a hot June and a very cool July and August. I believe it's August already. I would love to know the delay that Kalo is on. He picks number three. Her. I'm Trevor. Nice to meet you, I guess. Ugh. Yeah, I just got back from te teaching English to the underprivileged in Midtown. Of course he did. Oh, really? That's really cool. Wouldn't call it cool. I mean, it doesn't pay the bills, but I am giving back to the community, so it does gratify me on an emotional level. Wow, I hate this guy. <laughs> anyway, I'm afraid I have to go. I'm on a conference call with some of my business associates, planning to start a new nonprofit for starving children in Uganda. Wow, that's so cool. We should meet up again soon, Samantha. Have a drink. You still have my number, I take it? You two have a lovely rest of your date. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. See you later. Trip. That guy. He's really nice, but he's so conceited. <laughs> Her there, he just, just says, go fuck yourself, Jeff. Yeah, definitely got that vibe. It's all right, babe. So, be honest with me. What are you looking for right now? Tits. Ooh, it's I, my turn. Is it? Sorry. Getting a little too into this. Just a friend, and if it becomes more, so be it. Oh. Ah. I'm just looking for a friend. Someone I can hang out with and have fun with. And if it develops into something more serious, so be it. Yeah, I guess that's what I'm looking for, too. Aww. I mean, I definitely wouldn't want to force anything. And I believe the best relationships, the people start off as good friends first, you know? Take it slow. Definitely agree. Excuse me, does anyone have any change? Excuse me, my fine friend, do you have any change to spare? Sorry, man. I'm broke as a joke. That is a stupid sentence. Excuse me, darling, can you help a poor old veteran with some spare change? Um, sure. Here you go. Thank you kindly, dear. Excuse me, lovebirds. Can you spare any change? Who's up? Uh, that would be Lord Ariados. Oh, okay. I was like half afraid it was Ayla. Because that would have kind of messed us over. Anyway, Lord Ariados. Do we give this poor old veteran some change? They've actually arrested a few panhandlers recently. Here in Xenia? No, just like, it shows up in the Reddit feed I uh, watch. And it's just like... They make so much money. I'm not saying all panhandlers do, but And I'm like, not saying I would trade my normal life for being a panhandler. Lord Ariados says sure thing he's a vet and fucking deserves it. You're the <clears throat> sure, shit, what voice is that? Sure thing, man. Here you go. Thanks, young man. You're a true gentleman. Have a nice date, kids. And don't do drugs. Bye. You're up. Wow, that was really kind of you. I didn't know you were so giving. We might salvage the state yet. There's a lot you don't know about me, colon, close parentheses. Excuse me, I need to go to the bathroom and throw up because you just said an emote <laughs> at me. Be back in just a bit. Sure, no problem, babe. Uh, didn't you leave? You think you're manly with that beard? If that beard makes you manly, I must be the manliest guy in the world. <laughs> Didn't he leave, though? Yep. I thought Jeff left. I think he's making fun of his hipster face. I wonder I wonder what's taking her so long. Hipster stole my girl. Oh, shit! God damn it, Jeff! Fuck, man. Never gonna get late at this rate. I'm okay with this. I'm okay with these weird e or not great endings we're getting. That was episode one slash two. The Akamara is doodling, by the way, in case, uh, what the fuck? Why is it locked? Oh no! I have to complete it in order to do the, d oh, you suck, man. I want to do a different story. That's not fair that it locks it. You know what? We're gonna play the second one then. Cause screw you. We're gonna uh, switch to the flag. She climbed real out quick. the fucking window. She climbed out the window. Yeah. Oh Jesus. Just had to make sure I wasn't actually streaming that picture. All right. Uh, hold on a minute, everybody. While I load up the second one, we're gonna keep the same rotation though. No, we're gonna display two. There we go. There we go. 
and you will hear what I meant about how good the music is. Window capture, we're going to do that. Haboosh! And are you going to work? Yay! Oh, shit. And transition. Yay! There we go. All right. Flex and chill to millennials. Episode one, Melanie. So I've... God, I love the music in the second one. Like, I really do. I actually downloaded the soundtrack for a buck. This is the song that really got me interested in this game. It's so nice and relaxing. And also not. Is it Momiji Pyro? No, it was actually not Momiji. It was Neo Tengu doing something very naughty. Anyway, you're up, Melanie. Wow, Win, our first rave. I know! Isn't it awesome? We're really living the dream! Okay, first order of business, finding Tristan and John. And who's up? Uh, we're keeping the rotation, yep. so that would be... Let's see here. Tink. Tink is up. Alright, Tink, you are at a rave. What do we do? God, I love this music, and I don't know why. I usually don't like rave music. There's something about this... This isn't even really rave music, is it? I mean, kind of. It is? It's not. It aims more toward house than dubstep, but yeah. What is house? Um, just like DJ house music. It's the kind of music you'd play at a dance hall. I've never been Can't to one, club. so I'd probably have to hear it. Anyway, you're up. Tink's shows Let's Do All It. Alright, Win, let's do it. Yeah. Oops. Uh, what the fuck? Oh! Oh, arrow keys! Holy shit, that's old school! What? You, you alright, sir? Okay, then. This is about the kind of dance I could do if I was really in a dance club. A pretty cool place. I've got a speech bubble there. Let's keep exploring for a minute. I'm gonna stick my ears right beside the... Oh, I'm apparently having a seizure as I'm against the right wall. That's fine. Well, Winnie's looking at me like she doesn't know what the hell I'm doing. Yeah, talk to the people in the morph suits. Space bar. Your voice. Ew, what's up with those creepy masks? I think they're awesome. You would, weirdo. Aw, I like Melanie. Alright. Hey, guys! Tristan! John! Melanie! Winnie! Hey, ladies. We were wondering when you guys would get here. Oh, please. We always arrive fashionably late to the party. You guys having fun? For sure. Oh, for Fuck it. For sure. Though, though would be more fun with a bit of booze. You guys want to get some drinks before we do a bit of dancing? And get uh, drunk. Who's up? Tofa. Tofa's up. I always wanted a stro- Wait. They're not strobe lights. What is it? Party balls? That do those laser mirror balls? light delays? No. Mirror balls are like disco balls. Yeah, I that's what, that's what does that. No. You can make a electronic strobe that does it for you, but a mirror ball would do it. Yeah. No. I, it's, I know what I'm thinking of. It's a big black ball that has a... Oh, Topa says sure. Sure thing. Well, I want something delicious. Is your head not attached to your neck anymore, Winnie? Alright, I'm sure that's fine. I'll go grab us something. Oh, Hold she's on. wearing a choker. God. Me and Melanie will go grab something. Won't we, Mel? Uh, that would be Ayla. Not so, interested. Not interested. Ugh, do I have to? Let's just dance. Come on, Mel. Don't be such a stick in the mud. These boys demand drinks. Fine, whatever, but afterwards it's dancing time. Um, duh, that's the whole point. Aw, oh, Winnie. Alright, hold on, guys. <laughs> Why is she, looking at, is she looking at my mouse cursor? No, she's just looking off behind her for some reason. What, sorry? Winnie's hips. Winnie's hips? Ooh, talk oh, to she the does have a look. little bit of a wiggle to her step. Uh, uh, having trouble finding the hotspot there. Hi there! Uh, now Mouse. Oh hey, what's going on ladies? Melanie, what are you doing? I, uh, like your hair. Ha! 
Thanks. Mel, come on. Let's go. Sorry, she's not interested in whatever you're selling. Let's go. Drinks, bitch. I was hoping you would bust out the Becky voice. Do you want me to go full Becky for Winnie? The, you know, yes. Go full Becky for Winnie. Hey there. Excuse me. We like, stop. What are you doing? <laughs> um, Getting drinks? You don't buy drinks, Melanie. You're a pretty girl. What are you talking about? Didn't you just offer the guys drinks? I'm kind of confused right now. I'll take the guy on the left. You take the guy on the right. What are you talking about? Just follow my lead. We're not paying for any drinks tonight. <clears throat> hey, handsome. Oh, uh, hi there. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, okay, Tari. Tari is up. Tari, do we get free drinks or do we buy our own drinks? Let me know in the chat. Poor Melanie. She is very much out of her depth right now. The bartender looks like she wants to be anywhere but here. It's like, ugh. Can't bartender wait to go looks home. like she's got some good swag. Play some Final Fantasy fourteen. She just looked at the camera like, yeah. She did. Be a salute, says Tari. Okay, let me get some free drinks. Oh, uh, hey there, Hotshot. Hey there, what's up? Who's up? Uh, that'd be you. Um, we'll stick with Tari's choice. We'll just go for it. How about you, uh, buy me a drink, huh? Oh, um, sure. Why not? What do you want? What do we want? Uh, Kayla, what do we want? That third one is most certainly not alcoholic. And now I don't like Melanie's luck. She looks like she is definitely up to something. I know, right? Isn't this music catchy? The Akamura is dancing in her chair while drumming on her thighs to the beat. It's adorable. Halo says cranberry soda. We are going non-alcoholic here. I'll just get a cranberry soda. Thanks. Actually, we only have red punch, blue punch, or yellow punch. Oh, uh, okay. Um, take some, uh, yellow punch. Yellow punch? Guess I'll take the Ow, yellow punch then. bitch! Oh, that hurt. And a blue one from my friend John, thanks. Oh, God, I just busted my nail against my chair and it fucking hurt. Oh, God, who knew doing YouTube Let's Plays should have come with hazard pay? Anyway. Here you go. Thanks a bunch. Hey. Cranberries! Before you go, I just want to say you have a really cute smile. Aw. Oh, um, thank you? I'm not coming on to you, sweetie, don't worry. Just on the lookout for a model for my blog, and you're, like, super pretty. Would you be interested in helping out? Uh... It's up to you, Lord Aridos. She does have a cute smile. I'm definitely not one of those gamers who needs stellar graphics, and I think there's something kind of cute and relaxing and casual about graphics that are not pretty. Because it forces you to use your imagination, you know? But Melanie's yeah. cute. She has a That's... cute smile, and she has big eyes, and she's adorable. That's why people like Generation 1 of Pokemon, because the sprites were vague. Right. Lord Arito says, sure. Sure, I'd love to. Awesome. Meet up with me later, and I'll give you the details. Enjoy the drinks. Thanks. Hey, we'll be right back. Gotta go see our friends real quick. Let's go, Mel. Are we just stealing the drinks? We are. We're taking the dude's drinks. Oh, they look so worried over there, too. Uh. Oh, at least now she's smiling. Hi there. Oh, hey, what's going on? Oh, same thing. Melanie, what are you doing? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, we got it. Let's fucking go, girl. We're busy. Hi, John. We have to Hi, go Tristan. deliver drinks. Oh, here we go. Poor Melanie. She really does not want to be here. <laughs> that was a blast. I don't know. I really don't really feel right taking advantage of people like that. Oh, please. We're doing those guys a favor. They'll feel more confident now that some girls approach them and have a great night because of it. Winnie, are you having a seizure there? Or, 
Is something wrong with your with your access program? I'm fine. I'm dancing. Let's go. Uh, I don't know, Winnie. Oh, quit your whining and let's dance. Are you drunk already? Dance, bitch. <laughs> Fucking get your dance on. This is so adorable. Wow, Tristan's making a move. Mate, what the F do you think you're doing? We talked about this, mate. I'm dancing with Melanie when he's your girl. Mate, what's your problem? I'm just dancing where I'm dancing. Don't be an arse. You're being an arse. You're being an arse. Chav off. What? What? Chav off. Chav off? Uh, chavs, chavs are uh, basically British douchebags. Oh. Well, then why don't you let her decide for herself? Sounds good to me, chum. Melanie, you want to dance with me? With him. And he's got the herps. Who's up? Uh, Lord Ariados picked last, I think. So that'd yes. be Tink. Tink is up. Okay, who are we dancing with, Tink? Better decide quick before these two dudes squint, uh, just frown at each other to death. <laughs> yep, Kayla proved it. Chav battle. Wow, I am not up on my British parlance like the Akamura is. God, I love this music. Oh, the Akamura's getting so into it. One of the few times I wish we had face cam. What am I talking about? I wish she's always on face cam. I'm the one who wants to stay off it. Soon they're going to rip off their 50 polo shirts and fight over their cologne choices. I would pop some popcorn for that. So what is a chav? I mean, obviously it means douchebag, but it's, like, is it... Yeah, it's basically a loud, obnoxious youth. <laughs> I mean, like... Like, for us, I could see it evolving from the word Chad, since Chad is our, uh, is our default name for douchebags. Yep. From but what I understand, Chavs are English kids who act like American kids. I see. Ugh. Anyway, Tink wants to dance with Tristan. John, quit being such a baby. We're just dancing. Now I feel fuck bad. Oh, what if? Now, if you'll excuse us, we're going to dance for a bit without you. You guys can dance together for a bit. But, Melanie. Oh, burn. Bye, friend. <laughs> You're a great dancer, Melanie. Whoa. Oh, I uh, read that wrong. I thought she just said, don't hit me. Anyway. Tofa. Tofa's up. Look at me pump those arms. That is literally about as well as I can dance in real life. Where did their drinks go? Uh, Melanie still got hers. Right. Where? Where is? Where is Tristan's? No idea. Did he just gulp it all down? Tofa says, "Don't hit on me." Yep. It's a shorter version of a slur used by police back in the '60s in the UK for Charlie Average. Says Kalo. Huh. T I L. Okay. Come on, Tristan. Aren't you dating Winnie? I'd rather you didn't hit on me. What are you talking about? I went on one date with her. We're not together or anything. I like you, Melanie. You're so free-spirited. Date a chick to get at her friend. Classic. Yup. Who's Ayla! Up? Ayla, not interested. Sorry, Tristan. I'm not really interested. Hmm. It ain't over till it's over, babe. Okay, then. Uh... Okay. Tari. Tari. Do we get closer to Tristan? Look at those big brown eyes and all that long black hair and that tank top that hopefully he's wearing deodorant with because otherwise everyone's dying. Look at him lift each arm and see the braided armpit hair underneath. Eww. What is he, French? Burn. Wait, that's... I mean, That he's... would hit more if he was... Never mind. This is the kind of comedy you expect from Power Falcon's Let's Play Extravaganza. Tari wants us to basically dance outside. Go so. far away from him. <laughs> Let's uh, go meet up back up. With, go meet back up with the group. Oh yeah, sure thing. Ugh. Go talk to Sean uh, again. She's not having a good time. Winnie isn't having a good time either. Oh, no. Sean does, has nothing to say. Oh, where are the other guys? Oh, they're still there. I wonder if I can even talk to him. No. Aww. All right. 
Can I speed up or run or anything? No, nope, that's fine. Yeah, okay, it's that thing. See it at the top? The light oh, bulb? Oh, yeah, that thing. Yeah, I want one of those. I know they sell them at Spencer's. I just don't know how much they are. That'd be a they're, waste of money for us. Anyway. They're not expensive, actually. They're not that expensive, or they are expensive? I think they're inexpensive. You can get them oh, off yeah. of Amazon, too. I have to look at how much they are. I always wanted a strobe light, too. I used to have one. Oh, no! Oh, we're falling! Uh, 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 John. Ah! Be careful there. Oh, it's whoa. Whoa! Be careful there, Mel. Whew, that was a close one. Thanks, John. Uh, uh it's your turn. This is nice. I kinda... Okay, lovebirds. Can you stop making us feel like third and fourth wheel? We're here as a group, are we not? Aw, oh, hissy, Winnie. Jeez, what was that about? I'm bad at understanding basic human emotion. Yeah, what's her deal? Uh, Kalo. Kalo is up. Wow, that one lady in the back center between the exits, or it yeah, could be she's a dude. killing it. Yeah, wow, she is getting airborne on every step. Holy crap. Well, thank you, Kalo. As much as I appreciate that, Kalo says ignore her. I only realized Kalo said he needed ruin. Sure, she's okay. Probably just needs another drink. Wow, Melanie, uncool. Aren't you two good friends? Fine, I'll go see why she's being all moody. Mer, we're angers now. This is a but shitty still smiling. grave. Yep. What? Oh yeah. Oh, they are smiling now. Poor Mel. Mel is not smiling. She has had better days. Like what the f? Me hey, Wynn, Winnie? what's up? What do you mean, what's up? You know fully well what's up. Who's up? Um, that would be me. Uh. Did I do something wrong? Boop. Did I do something wrong, Wynn? Wow, Melanie, you really are clueless, aren't you? Just so tired of them giving you all the attention. I mean, aren't I cute too? Rodarius? You're up. <laughs> I know Ayla's busy and all, but I really want to give Ayla full control of one of these games one of these days. I really want to get Batman too. The new Batman season came out. I'm arguing with myself whether to buy that immediately. Make Batman a dick. Lord Ariados, you said is up? Yep, three. So, three. Are you serious, Winnie? You're gorgeous. <laughs> You're just saying that. Tank. Tank. They have very thick eyebrows, too. Aw, so cute, though. Fuck when I don't want to ruin something somehow. What? Oh, oh, oh. He doesn't oh. want to ruin the friendship. Yeah, yeah. I misunderstood what he was saying. God, I clipped again. Bad. Shit, man. What's going on with my volume today? I'm just crazy loud. There we go. I think I fixed me. I think says, I mean it. Of course I mean it, Winnie. You're my most beautiful friend by a long shot. Ah, friends. You're right. I am beautiful, and I don't need any stupid guy to tell me anything else. Let's go to Starbucks in our Uggs. <laughs> in our pajamas. It'll be great. We'll look so trashy. Yeah. Yeah, oh. that's the spirit, Winnie. That just line stole from you for some reason. I think I'm going to dance by myself for a while. You know, have some me time away from those jerks. Feel free to come meet up with me if you want. Thanks, Mel. Aw. So, what are we doing here? Oh, you can talk to her again. I think that's the ending. Yeah, I think it's ending time. Who's up? Uh, Tofa. All right, Tofa, I'm going to give you two since I don't know if this is going to work or not. Oh, but... you still need to meet up with the bartender lady, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let's actually just do that. Let's go talk to the bartender lady. See if that even works. She hasn't done much dancing today. She's sort of... Oh, yeah. Cool. Let's do it. Mm. Get a drink instead of dancing. Don't get a drink. Oh. Maybe, Maybe later. later. Okay. Okay. All right. Tofa, I'll probably wind up giving you two here. Um, Tofa, who would you like to dance with? Is it this guy, which is Tristan... Or blonde John here. Hey, buddy. Or would you like to dance with Melanie? 
I'll give you the choice of that one and then probably give you the next dialogue choice too. But who would you like to dance with? I am going to need another Mellow Yellow. I need caffeine since I stay up way too late every night. I'm hiding Hello. behind John. You can't see me now. You can't see me. You can't see me. I can kind of see you sometimes. Topa says Mel. All right, we're gonna head over to or Winnie. I meant, but yeah, we all know who we're talking about. Hey, Win. Hey, babe. <laughs> Don't you want to dance with one of the guys? Um, no. Topa picked her, so we'll just stick with us. No, Win. I want to dance with you. Really, Mel? Totally. Well, in that case, let's party. Aww. Mel, I am having so much fun tonight. Me too, Win. I think we can consider our first rave night a smashing success. And I learn a valuable lesson that you don't need stupid boys to have a good time. Yeah, no one needs stupid boys. <laughs> True that, Win. Melanie, I really want to thank you. Without you, I'd be feeling more insecure about myself and still getting all upset over Tristan. Uh... Uh... Yeah, this is Ayla. a different thing, so yeah, we'll we'll just keep but going. When it was Topa all you, <laughs> I didn't do anything. You only have yourself to thank. Aw. Still, Mel, you make me feel really good. You're a really good friend, and I really appreciate you. I'm glad I can be there for you, Winnie. Really though, you make me feel really good. Like I don't have a care in the world. Now, Kiss. Mel, I think I may like you. What do you mean? I mean. I just had so much fun with you tonight. Like, the only fun times I had was when it was just you and me. I feel like I need you. Need you to make me feel like I don't need them. You know? Did that make sense? I hope that makes sense. It made sense to me in my head. Hey, do you like me too? Do I need to, like, send you a third grade note? Come on! Answer me! You're just staring at me with that sad sheep face! Come on! <laughs> Sorry, you're up. <laughs> oh my god, Mel! Give me an answer! You can't leave me hanging like this in the middle of a fucking rave full of sweaty teenagers. Aw. Love this do you, do you want me to go get one of those weird little morph set masks? Because I can go do that. Aw. That'd be cute. I can be anything you dream, Mel. Anything you dream. Okay. Now it's getting a little creepy. Tari says, let them kiss. I think... I think I may like you too, Win. Really? You really mean that? You're not just saying that, right? No, I mean it. I always have so much fun with you too, and it's not just because you're a goofball, but because you make me feel confident as well. Aww. Without you, I don't know I feel the same way. Yay! You know, why don't we get out of here? Yeah, let's go. Aw. Yeah, who needs stupid boys? During my first rape tonight. Wish me luck. Wish me luck. Oh. Boop. Boop. You can't see that by boop their noses with my mouse cursor. Aw. Oh, that was a very nice way to end that. All right, let's do one more and then we'll head to the after party. These are taking a little longer than I thought they would. Episode two, Frank. Yeah, be Frank. Who's up first? Um, so we get ready for it. Well, Tari just gave us the gay option, so you're up. <laughs> you may for oh god, that is so me immediately. You may you force many to think differently about you. That wait what? Okay, let me try that line again. You force many to think differently about you. That charged they heavily to your account. You came nigh to them, and yet went past. For that, they never forgive you. You go beyond them. But the higher you rise, the smaller does the eye of envy see you. Most of all, however, is the flying one hated. Oh, oh. How the fuck do you pronounce that? I've never heard Nietzsche. it. Nietzsche. Nietzsche? I've never heard it pronounced out loud. Nietzsche is one of my favorite, uh, philosopher peoples. 
Do you his, recognize those lines? Not really, because I don't read enough of his shit, but a lot of his stuff was fucked up by his sister, who wrote in a bunch of Nazi bullcrap. Wow. Oh, and Lord Erido says he loves this track, too. Dude, um, the music of this game is available as a DLC for only one dollar. Two bucks gets you the game and the soundtrack. It's, like, five songs, which is still, like, way cheaper than you would get on iTunes. Yep, a lot of Nietzsche <laughs> stuff awesome. paraphrased is what kind of led me to my whole nihilism thing. Yeah. The day's what you make it! Yay! Also, I agree with L.A. listening to his violins. Shit, yeah, this is smooth F. Love it. Oh, Nietzsche, how your cryptic philosophy speaks to me, so. Hey, Frank, reading on the job? Hey, Tyler. Yeah, just reading a few quotes to get me geared up for the next 10-hour stretch. These quotes are the only thing that get me through these 12-hour workdays. Well, cut it out. We don't have time for you to be taking reading breaks. The dad didn't start this company so you could have leisure time. We're here to make profit. You're not going to contribute. We're just dead weight. Let's hook up with Tyler. Fuck Tyler. Metaphorically let's, in the face. Let's hook up with Tyler. Let's ruin his life by being the best thing that ever happened to him. And then dumping him? Is that what you're saying? I'm confused. No, he doesn't like you, so we're gonna be the best thing that ever happened to him. Get the fuck out of my face, bitch! Yeah, um, so sorry. I'll stop reading. Ah, oh, it is me. Ah, oh, you better. This code better be top notch by the end of the week, or else. Look at my pompadour. Alright, well, let me get to it. Another cup of coffee will gear me up and get me going. But we're gonna go the opposite way first. Do you guys agree? Should we hook up with Frank? Ugh. What's up, dude? What's up, lady? Oh, uh, I thought she was looking at me for a minute. No, she's reading too. God, this music is really good. Alright, we're gonna head on over here. I'm gonna just add these songs to my iTunes rather than just have them as loose MP3s. Tofa <laughs> wants us to be with Frank. We'll see how this goes. Ah, oh, crap, there's no coffee. How the hell am I gonna get any work done without coffee? And space, thank God. Oh yeah, we ran out a few hours ago. Let me go to the cafe down the road, buy us some, give you a chance to take a break. Oh, uh, thanks, Tyler. Sure. I'll take a unicorn for Rappalapuccino. Frappalapuccino. Make it snappy. Uh, yeah, sure. Ugh, All goddamn right. unicorn piece of shit. All right, well. Oh, was that the crack guess... article that said that? Oh, yeah, that is a that's real a thing. That's a nightmare for people. Making limited time offers is a nightmare yes. for people. Oh, uh, you would know with your one pizza, I can't say, since it, it would identify which chain you work for. It is a pain <laughs> in the ass to make, but it makes us a lot of money. All right, well, I guess I better get everyone's orders. Uh, see, that's me. I'll think of, like, get the fuck out of my face, but I'll just immediately crumble, because that's the kind of person I am. I think you're a dude? No, oh, you have boobs. Hey, Katie. Oh, hey, Frank. Tyler making you his coffee boy again? Yeah, I guess so. Fuck, why am I doing the Frank voice? Or the Tyler voice? Yeah, I guess so. Man, I don't know how he expects you to get this absurd amount of work done if you're running his errands all the time. You gotta stick up for yourself, Frank. Don't let him push you around like that. Who's up? That would be... Let's see here. You chose first? Yes. So, Kalo. Kalo is up. Please make your selection in the chat. Oh, God. Shit. Okay. So God damn it. Him. Fuck, man. Sorry, I just clicked like 18 wrong things. Luckily, I accidentally picked the one Kayla wanted us to choose. Anyway. Well, I'll have a coffee then. Black like my soul. I apologize for all of that. Hello, Shogun of Japan. You got it. Hey, you should bring Christina. Who? C Christina? Yeah, I think she could use a little bit, bit of a breather too. Tyler's been hitting on her all day long. Reading on the job? How cute. 
I swear, Tyler hired you to harass her and harass in one way and her to harass in another. Well, maybe Dick. we should get Tyler to harass us in that one way. <laughs> anyway, it's also a bookstore, and she likes books just as much as you. Plus, it's pretty obvious you have a crush on her. R really? Yep, I swear, it's a page out of Beauty and the Beast. And he's like Gaston, and you're like a nerdy beast or something. Aw, that's actually cute. Anyway, like just ask her if she wants help with the coffee. I'm sure she'd love to come along. Just don't mention Nietzsche. Pretty sure she just reads the romance books all day, and that stuff is not for the faint of heart. Noted. Lord Arita says we should get with Christina to bang her and get back at... What? I guess he get means back get at back at Tyler. Tyler. Yeah, that's what I'd figure. Hey, buddy. Do you need a coffee? Because I'm running out anyway. Hey, Ronnie. Hey, Frank. Man, great job on your section of the code. You're killing it, brother. Killing it. <laughs> Thanks. You're coming to the coffee shop? Yep. My latest critical task by our favorite boss with a capital B. Wow. Well, if it's on company dollars, I'll take a latte. Thanks, man. No problem. All right, so we got a unicorn, black coffee, latte. Oh, shit, yeah. I guess we should be keeping track of this shit, shouldn't we? Uh, hey, Christina? Oh, hey, Frank. What's up? Uh, oh, who's up? Uh, let's see here. Kalo did pick, and it kind of worked out. So it's my turn, and I want to sell the Frank thing, so what kind of coffee would you like? I'm getting coffee for the office. Which kind would you like? Oh, I'm all set. I don't drink coffee. Oh, oh that's that's okay then. What are you reading? What which, which book are you reading? Oh, this just a silly romance novel. You know, girl stuff. And who's up? Uh, Lord Ariados. <laughs> that middle option is so rude. Oh, Come man. on, Lord Ariados. Team gay option. Team gay option? Lord Eridos is three. Cool! Well, uh, hey. I'm going to the cafe bookstore to grab coffee for the office. Um, you can come with and get some fresh air for a bit if you want. You know what? Sure. Why the heck not? We'd love to pick up a new book, too, if we have the time. Aw. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Let's do it. There's this one book from this one dude named One Step Toward Divinity that you should totally buy. It's a, it's not a romance book, but it's a really good adventure with romance in it. But anyway, even though you can pick that up on Amazon and Audible with the links in the video description, do you like working at this nondescript company we don't have a, ty a name for? It's all right. You know, it has its pros and cons, just like any job. Wow, what a shutdown phrase. Yup. Anyway, who's up? Uh, let's see here. Tink. Tink is up. Are we Fred Flintstoning this? We're just gonna walk around on the same background until we continue? Yep. I'm okay with that. I'm basically walking in circles. Lord Arido says he's jamming to the music. It is so good, the violin completes the track. Is this an ironic comedy of office pettiness? Uh, possibly. Shogun of Japan slash Nuke Piggy. Glad you are back with us. If you want to be added to the rotation, let us know in the chat. Tink says option three. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's good to have money, but sometimes I feel overworked. Overworked is an understatement. You seem to be tasked with quite the load at the moment. You know, when I got the job, I thought the team would be bigger. I was surpri pretty surprised when I found out it was just the three of you. What do you mean? Well, it's just, are you ready to raid? Yes. Well, it's just the amount of projects that comes through our firm is huge. I thought it was like some kind of big company or something. Yeah, no, that's just me and the guys. Pretty impressive. <laughs> wow, thanks. Beautiful day today, huh? Uh. Next know. up is Tofa. Tofa. And the chat one, it was the perfect size for this. Oh. Nick Piggy, that is okay. Selling your summer for money is good. And more games to buy. Not to mention, you know, food and shoes and other critical needs. Option two. Yeah, it's really nice out. Good day for a stroll. Really looking forward to some coffee. She looks bored. Oh, this uh, is awkward. 
Ayla. So you don't drink coffee? No, you used to be addicted, but I don't know. It stains your teeth, you know? Switch to green tea and never look back. Yuck. Pretty impressive. I used to drink green tea primarily, but this job requires a little more. Rough. How long have you been working here? Two years. Started as an intern after college and haven't stopped. Nice. Two years in a small company and you're the head programmer. You must be doing pretty okay. Okay, how? Like, money-wise, you must be doing pretty well. Do you get a share of revenue or something? Um, I get paid... enough. Wait, have you even been promoted since you started working here? Um, no. Hmm. Aw, she knows he's kind of a pushover. Who's up? That would be... Tari. Tari! What do we ask our lovely lady Christina here? Talk about us! Turn her off! Japan says... Independent, so I'm using it all for a new computer. Hey, dude. No worries there. I would have absolutely done the same thing. Like, I actually needed a slightly more powerful rig for some of the some of the games I want to do Tari for the show. Tari says one. Not to mention some of the games on my uh, own behalf. So what do you do when you're not shuffling around Tyler's papers? Oh, well, you know, romance novels, tending to my cats, going Aww. to the park, etc., etc. Sounds fun. I love cats. I do. <laughs> yeah, everyone loves cats nowadays. True. Very, very true. How much longer till we get there? Not too far. Haven't you been there before? I thought you'd get Tyler's coffee. I usually just grab Tyler's fancy frappalapitas chinos in my car on my way to the work. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're almost there. You know, those things are horrible for you. I get sick just looking at them. <laughs> Same. I'm pretty sure they're, or I'm sure they're pretty delicious, though. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> We're hypocrites, aren't we? Who is in this day and age? This does feel like a real conversation. Right. Who's up? Your turn. Cats. Cats. Hence why the internet loves them so much. They're the perfect antithesis, antithesis to the modern adult. Straightforward about their needs, compact, low maintenance. Wow, we are so goddamn obsessed, millennials. obsessed, think they're the center of the universe, and expect others to pick up their poo. We're like the perfect counterpart to millennials. Our mirror image, really. Hmm, never thought of it that way. Maybe you're right. Trust me, I live with one. I'm basically an authority on the subject. Aw, oh, maybe you should write a book about it. <laughs> New York Times best-selling author, here I come. Not sure how you'd make a romance novel out of that, though. <laughs> it wouldn't be a romance novel. It would be a philosophy book. The zen of maintaining a tiny, self-obsessed person. Wow. Sounds pretty deep. I like it. Ah, here we are. Time to get Tyler's unicorn frappa lappuccino. Did you hear about how that was, like, a big deal? Mm, no. Tyler doesn't let me road the new... Oh, read. God damn. Tyler doesn't let me read the news at work. He monitors my web browsing. That's unsettling. Yep, sure is. Oh, Frappuccino is intellectual property. Really? Huh. I always thought it was a generic term. Anyway, all right, now to get the coffee. If it's a mix between a frapp and a cappuccino, go for it. I'm going to check out the books. Okay. Magazine's here. Sup, sir? Oh, hey, I can talk to you. What the fuck? Does he just sigh whenever I hit the space bar? Or is he psyching himself up? I guess he's psyching himself up. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Got also 90% sure Barnes & Noble's is the bookstore. Yeah, there aren't many coffee shop bookstores in America. Hey There's there. a lot of them in Japan. Oh, uh, hey. What are you working on? Oh, just making some flyers for an open mic. I'm running at another cafe. You want to come? Uh... Kalo! Wow. Didn't expect to get a dialogue choice with some rando at the coffee shop slash bookstore. But... Okay. We have a very tiny, tiny, tiny bookstore here called Blue Jacket Books. 
and they have coffee there as well. Yes, they also and have muffins. They sometimes. have invited me to go in at any time to work on my book, which I cannot do since I can't do voice work there. But anyway, not interested. Sorry, not really interested in that kind of stuff. Uh, okay, well, is there some other reason you're talking to me then? <laughs> Just saying hi. Fuck. Who's up? I am. Oh, okay. Just saying hi. Um, well, hi. Anyway, gotta get back to work. So, see ya. Right. Oh, we can't talk to it. Oh, is this the bartender? Hey there. Oh, It is, it's hey. the bartender from You're the Frank, first right? episode. I've seen you here before. Yeah, I'm Frank, and you are? I'm Teresa. Good to meet you, Frank. Okay, weird question, but aren't you like a super awesome programmer or something? Why do you know about me? Who's up? Uh, Lord Ariados. Lord Ariados. Uh, let's see. Nuke Piggy has a local bookstore called Tatnux. It's large, but never seems to have the books I need. I wonder how you go about getting a printed book into a bookstore. Like, I wonder if... I don't know. Anyway. It would require a distributor, at least. Yeah. I just ask Blue Jacket Books. I still need to look in how to do a print run of my novel. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. Oh, awesome. You are totally the guy I'm looking for then to program my blog. Uh, program a blog? That's pretty easy work. Are you sure you need my help? Sorry, I... We really do. My We're clueless and definitely need someone professional on board. Would you mind helping us with that? Uh... I, uh who's up? Uh... Tink. Tink. Huh. I wonder if... She's a connecting thread in all the episodes. That's really cool. All of this excitement is happening in this one town. People hooking up, people getting into relationships with other people. So amazing. Um, catching up on the chat. What is the bookstore that we, you and me and Sparkless went to in the green? Uh, that's a good question. Is that an independent one or is it a big chain? I think it's independent, but like, I mean, it could be a chain. They did Books not have Co. coffee, but they had ice cream. Yes, they had a which brilliant was awesome. place. It was very strange. Tink says not interested. Sorry, I've kind of got a lot on my plate at the moment. Oh, okay. No problem. Alright, coffee time. Let's see. Wow. Lots of people to talk to. Let's so find Christina. No, no Christina. Alright, let's talk to the cute blonde This makes me want to play lady. Sims. Yeah, it is very sims light, isn't it? Simsy. Hi there! Hi, Frank. Getting your boss's coffee again? Yep. He wants to try the unicorn one every... Oh, he wants to try the unicorn one everyone keeps talking about lately. Uh, sorry. Who does he think we are? Scoob rats? We don't make those here. We're a local cafe. We sell coffee. Okay. Hmm. Have any idea of what he'd like instead? <laughs> Mocha Frapple Appalachino. Just get him nothing. Who's up? Oh, let's see here. That would be... Tink was the last one. Tofa. Tofa! Come on! You desperately want to get with... Be my hero! Let's get with Frank! Why do you want to get with Frank exactly? Because it'll be hilarious. Will it? Will it? It's your boss's son. Wait. That's like... I thought Tyler was the boss. It's his dad's company. Oh, okay. I'm with you. Tofa says so... three. Mocha Frappalapuccino. Just get him a Mocha Frappalapuccino. I'm sure that'll be sugary enough for him. And if I didn't get him something with whipped cream, I'd probably get fired. Jeez, Frank. You're really worried about getting fired. I thought you were good at your job. Yeah. Me too. Well, what can I get for you? Something sugary to cheer you up? I'll just take a coffee with cream. Sugar makes me crash. Classy guy. All right. Coffee with cream for you. Anything for that girl you walked in with? Ooh, who's up? That would be... 
Ayla. Ah, uh, Ayla is sabotaging us from Scotland, even though she's not playing along. She'll probably want a coffee with cream, too, because I don't pay attention to what people say. All right, well, how about the rest of your crew? Latte. La oh, cool. Yep, a latte for Ronnie and a black coffee for Katie. Nice, I'll have those already, already in just a bit. You can go check out the books or something while you wait. Sounds good. Thanks. Uh, Let's talk to this lady. She looks morose. Morose? Did Tari get skipped? Nope, it's Ayla and then Tari. Okay, so Tari's got the next one. Hey there. Sorry, I'm... Wait, is that a dude? I honestly can't tell. The cup is blocking the chest. You take the voice. Fuck it. Sorry, I'm really busy at the moment, but Heather can help you if you need something. Oh, okay, thanks. Wow, that was productive. Let's go find our girl, who is going to be super pissed at us we didn't get a green tea. Uh, okay. Boy, I hope I'm walking the right direction to didn't just leave. All right. This music is awesome. Oh, I can sit. Oh, the beanbag chairs. And sit. Ah. <sighs> I wonder if I'm going to float to you now that I'm going to start moving. Oh, I did not get up. Got myself up. Hold on one second, Christina. I'm going to explore my environment. Uh, okay. Let's talk to you. How are you, my dear? Hey, find a good book yet? Nah, still looking. Now you're up, Tari. I <laughs> just caught that second. So goddamn rude. Oh, I like long hair. Your hair is so long. It really is. It's half my height now. It is. It's wonderful. One. Need some help? Mm, I don't know. I'm just kind of browsing. Unfortunately, we don't have a ton of time. I'm gonna have to help her pick something. Don't be a dick, dude. Let's see. Uh, do I... Is there a hot spot? Or... She's watching you, dude. She does not care about books right now. Nope. Oh, here we go. Ha, <laughs> wow. This bring, brings back memories. What's that? Larry Blotter and the Wizard's Revenge. I've never read that. Are you serious? I thought everyone's read those books. Not me. I wasn't into those kinds of books growing up. Uh, who's... You're up. Wait. Yeah, you're up. I'm up. Uh, let's not be dickish, so let's be all passionate. But you should get it! I feel like I kind of missed out on the hype, and sans hype, it would be kind of boring, no? Kalo. Aw. Oh. We'll see if he goes against my uh, line of. You don't need excitement. hype to enjoy something. But we're millennials. We have to have hype, or it's dumb. <laughs> Did that hurt you, the Akamura? Yes. You can totally enjoy something without the hype. That's why they're called cult classics. And yep, Lord Aridos found the tracks. Apparently, option two. Yeah, maybe you're right. Man, those books basically define my childhood. Did you dress up as him and go to the movies? <laughs> I feel like that's something you would do. Uh, maybe... You totally did. I can see you with that scar on your head. Yeah, it was a really good time, but... But what? Aww. My turn. Childhood regrets. You know... I think it's kind of sad. What is? Well, our generation's childhood is basically defined by us sitting inside all the time, watching cartoons and playing video games and reading these silly books. Previous generations went outside and played, and, well, I feel like something was missing in my childhood. I don't know. I think it's alright. I grew up on a farm and was constantly outside. It was great, but sometimes I get the feeling that I missed out on the other stuff. I mean, never even played video games, really. Wow, you've never read Larry Blotter and never played video games. You, my friend, are an anomaly. Anyway, I recommend this book. It's good stuff. 
but I'll keep that in mind. All right, are we done here or? Maybe I need to bug out? I'm kind of confused. Oh, cool! A European travel guide! Oh, that sounds cool. I've always wanted to go to Europe. You've never been? No, but I've always wanted to. Have you? <laughs> Do we lie or not? Who's up? Lord Ariados. Say. Hype has ruined so many things for me because it got expectations so unrealistically high. Yes. I agree. Excuse me. Too much soda. It's one of the reasons why I try to dodge it as much as possible. Probably why I basically didn't hate No Man's Sky when it came out. Lord Ariados tells the truth. No? Not yet. Something you'd be interested- so, Oh, sorry. It's I was alright. I was uncomfortable. I was adjusting. I'm sorry. Something you'd be interested in doing someday? And who's up? Uh, Tink. Tink. And... The Steelers game. Yep, it's football. Oh yeah, I guess training or yeah, training camp happened and preseason's going. Holy shit! God damn, this year's been flying by for me. It's okay, Purple Pancakes. If you want to join the game, let us know. Steelers are winning. Oh, oh are you asking, Tank? Yeah, give us the score, PP. I would love to know what the score is. Just drop everything for sports. Anyway, who's up? Sorry, I know you just answered Tank's now, I up. forgot. Tank is up? Okay. But, uh, shoot, I'm gonna have to check that out. I'm still in a baseball mood. I've been watching the Cubs, and my phone is still being an ass. They're gonna piss me off. It's definitely the phone and not the charger, because... Oh, is that the problem? I think I may have just fixed it. I think it's the angle of the... It just thinks there's water in it? I think. I know I've kind of damaged the table, so it wouldn't surprise me. Tink says one. One? Absolutely. Are you kidding me? I'd absolutely love to travel more. Something I've been dreaming of for a long time. Well, what's holding you back? Well, I only have so many vacation days, you know? Oh, I see. I hear Sweden has a six-hour workday. Sounds like something you'd ben benefit from, yeah, now. Yeah, that'd be nice. I don't know if that's true. I though. have a six-hour workday. Sometimes. Yep. Yeah. Who's up? That'd be... Tofa. Tofa! Could you go get me a bowl of rice, please? I'm gonna throw my phone into it. So the Asians can come out and fix it? Since you tied them? I might cut that. I might actually cut that out of the archive. Topa says one. I don't mind working so much. It's really not all that bad. Wow, really? You're quite the champ. Yeah, and plus, I'm not sure if... What? I'm sure it won't last much longer anyway. I've been working nonstop. How much more do we have left? After this end of the quarter sprint, I'm sure I'll be getting a promotion or at least some free time. End of quarter sprint? What do you mean? The end of quarter sprint, you know? The reason why we have so many projects right now. Are you Tyler's secretary? You should know about this. Um, Frank, I hate to tell you this, but we're not doing any kind of sprint. We're starting a client portfolio expansion. Tyler's trying to double the amount of clients we have permanently. Wait, what now? You didn't know this? Oh boy. Wait, are we hiring more employees? That could be a good thing. I don't think that's Tyler's plan, Frank. He keeps talking about keeping costs low. Sorry, Frank. Oh. Are you alright? I, uh... I don't know. Do you want to get back to work, then? Kinda not. Um, let me see who's up. Maybe I should not have asked the Akamura to leave since she had the lift. So Ayla is up now, which means we pick option two. They can wait. You know what? No. Tyler can wait a little while. We're going to find you a book first. Plus, this is nice. Yeah, it's re a really nice store. Frank Heather! Er, <laughs> wow. 
I am off my cold reading game today. Frank, coffee's good to go. Okay, grab our drinks, but let's keep browsing for a bit. Yes, let's, whoa, what the fuck? I just pulled a book out of my ass, or my armpit. I'm about to chuck my phone into the wall. That's not true. It's a Galaxy S7, and I still have, like, 18 payments left on it, so... I guess... Yeah, that's fine. Here, just toss it on my... Doesn't look like I've got any more hot spots here in the book place. Stick my phone in the rice real quick. Problem is my phone keeps informing me that there is moisture in the charging port, which means it's not charging, just stupid. So, having to deal with this shit, dealing with other shit. Atari will be up next. We have another choice soon. Hi, Heather. Here you go, Frank. You know, you know oh. I've been hearing what you're talking about, and you guys are getting pretty deep over there. Wow, voices carry. But, I don't know, we're just bantering, really. I don't know, it's probably not my place, but you two are cute together. Uh, okay, Tari, you have the choice here. Please select one of those three options. Push Why? her away, we're going for Tyler. Push her away, we're going for Tyler. Bury my phone in. Ew, what is this nonsense mess? Oh man, it's been a while since I've taken my phone off. I don't even know how good Atlanta is anymore. I haven't been following the NFL NFL like I used to. Ew, what is this crap on my phone? Did you accidentally put it in some kind of... Oh, I don't know. I mean, I've always had the case on it since I bought it. So whatever this is, yeah, I guess some liquid got between the case and the thing. Uh, <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. I don't know. It's kind of unprofessional. I'm trying not to go there. Jeez. I'm not saying you guys have to get married. Sorry, I forgot. Just saying there's a spark between you two. It's cute. Thanks for noticing, I think. Alright, let's, uh, let's get out of here, I suppose. Do I need to go fetch her? I guess I need to go fetch her. Are there only two cups there? Looks like there's only two cups. Yeah, it looks like you're holding a four-pack. Uh, businesses, aka business term for firing Frank and hiring cheap college colleagues. Yes. Graduates, rather. I'm <clears throat> sorry. Like I said, my reading comprehension is down because I'm getting distracted too much here. I bought you a coffee because I'm an idiot. Oh, Frank, I don't drink coffee. I already told you that. Oh, oops. I totally forgot. Or for me, I guess. Hey, so I was poking around the business section and check this out. Oh, she's not even all that upset. Starting your own in your own business for imbeciles. I need yeah. that book. I was just thinking if things don't work out at our current company. And who's up? Uh, Tari just went, so it's Yo your turn. I'm going to make it. Wait, no, that's a good idea. Yeah, I meant I'm going to make my own business a good uh, anyway. You know, that's a pretty good idea. You really think so? Yeah. You know, if things don't work out here, I could easily start freelancing or something. But to be honest, I don't know a thing about running a business. Hence the book. Who's up? Uh, Kalo. Okay. Now well, I'm going to see how to get the cover off my phone. How do you get the cover off this phone? Do you know? The cover? Yeah, the big cover to no, pop the I battery. See. I may actually have to look that up. I've never popped the cover off this phone. Kayla says, scene. do it! Alright. Which is, I'll think about it because Frank is a ween, so... I'll think about it. Yeah, you know what? I'll think about it. Thanks, Christina. Glad to help. If I were, theoretically speaking, of course, to start my own business, what kind of advice would you have to offer? Well, I don't know. There's lots of things you could do. Be respectful to the people that you hire, sell what you know and are good at, work in an industry with high demand. Like YouTube videos? 
Wow, you sure know a lot about business. Actually, I just read the little blurb on the back of that book. <laughs> Aw, she's so charming. I see. That's not bad advice. But my main opinion is just be bold and do it. If it's something you want to do, of course. Fuck yeah. To be honest, it is something I've considered doing for a long time. I don't know, it's just hard to imagine anything else but this job at the moment. My mind's a blur. Oh, I feel that, buddy. Well, if it's something you would do, let me know. I'll be your secretary. Aw. And next? Uh, my turn. I don't know if it would be a good idea. Aw. I honestly don't know if that would be a good idea. Why not? Lord Ariados. Ah, oh, I I actually kind of like this, that you and Lord Ariados are kind of fighting each other with where we're taking the story. That's what I've always wanted from these episodes, not conflict, but that's why I do these in rotation. Like, this is the fun I have, seeing us fight each other, so to speak, and it makes a unique story as a result, you know? Lord Ariados says one. Because I like you, Christina, and... I don't know if that would be very professional. Is there a rule that all bosses have to have a crush on their employees? For Pete's sake. Forget I said anything, then. I'm just being honest. Whatever, Frank. You know what? I don't want to book anymore. I'm going back to the office. Oh. Oh. Okay. See you there. Oh. Yeah! Oh, Frank, his heart is so broken. You may force yourself to, th you may, f you force many to think differently about you. Da -da -da. Does anyone know any mediation techniques or something? Feeling really stressed. Oh, uh, I couldn't get with Tyler. Bullshit. No. Oh, God. What a dick. God damn it. That was incredibly rude. That's bullshit. You should totally be able to get with Tyler. Ah, uh, So that's Flix and Chill 2, Millennials, and of course we played Flix and Chill 1. Both are available on Steam for only 99 cents each. As I record this, I think they're on sale for 49 cents each. The soundtrack is DLC, also only 99 cents each, and the music is really good, as you are hearing now. I recommend picking them up. The game is a lot of fun, and when it's less than a cup of unicorn frappa lappuccino, then, you know, you should give it a go. No one was happy the way that ended. <laughs> but, uh... Hey, if you guys like this game, maybe we can revisit it in the future, but we have been streaming slightly longer than an hour and a half for the main show, so it's time for the after party, and we will let the game lie as it is now. I'm going to see if I can get through at least episode one of the original so we can unlock it, and then maybe we can revisit this at a later date. So... Unfortunately, Tari, we've got plans for today's after party, so no Jackbox 3. We might do it next week, though. Um, anyway, that will do it for the main show, so if you are watching this live, please stick around for the after party, where we're going to do a little Final Fantasy work for a little while. If you are watching this from the archive, however, thank you very much for watching, and I hope you flex and chill today, too. Either way, I will see you next week for another stream. Bye.